That true. horrible, that horrible ass fight we just saw. Yeah, that was. That was it was. Right. It was mad signs. Give me my money, matter of fact, my nigga. What happened? I got my phone's in the other room. I got you. Wow. <laughs> um, it was mad signs that your man was gonna lose, though. I'm mad as hell. I lost. But it was mad. I just don't like. Nah, I just can't believe you. You voted. You. Everybody in here lost except me and Amar. Yeah, yeah. I was going for for Woodley. Okay. I ain't gonna lie. Was wrong. Was cool. But so I can't believe you. You went yeah, with the Yaku. You for the. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the Yaku. Yeah, you you were happy that he won. You there was no cheering in the room. At all. You celebrate? No, you celebrate mm-hmm. his win. No you were celebrated? you were gleeful in his in his victory. I have never been. I've never been gleeful myself. <laughs> both mm-hmm. both mm-hmm. you enjoyed his never. victory. No. And you, you and you pay. both and you both profited off it. You you continue to ask me. That's the only we fact that you said. With five <laughs> years for your life for the an downfall, hour and a half. The downfall. But nobody was gleeful. We was mad about to get. You was about to get paid yeah. by a black man. Melancholy. That's the downfall of but, another black man. But you already said that. So and you're happy. You and you're happy. And you said those jokes three times. We laughed. And nobody laughed. And you and it brings joy to you. Ain't nobody here to laugh today. That's what I'm saying. We already laughed. That was funny to you. It brings joy to you. It doesn't bring joy. Right. The fight was terrible. Right. It was a bad fight. Yeah, right. terrible fight, fight. Fight was terrible. I'm Your still. Man shit said booty wipes on the back of his of his trunk. I didn't co-sign that. I have. I have. I, have, I don't support said. that in With any pink, way, shape, or form. With pink, pink trunks. And your man told him the nigga that you was voting for told him that he was happy to get the other nigga's name saying I love him. Uh, he, he was wilding at the end. Of the <laughs> was he wilding? Was Definitely. He? Okay. Definitely. I'm still was not. He? I'm still not impressed with Jake Paul though. He, he just needs to pay the. He still uh, his he footwork seems sloppy. Think he like won that fight, I think he survived. Seen gas. The fight. I don't think he survived the fight. No, he, he absolutely won that fight. He, nigga lost one round. He survived the fight. It wasn't like he. He, he may have gotten hit once. He may have got hit. He had the reach time. advantage. Like Tyron controlled the the ring the whole time. Like he chased him down. Like he tired him. Always out. the niggas ain't never been in the ring once in their yeah. life. That be I'm just saying. Saying nah. words. There was no control in that fight. Yeah, it was exhibited by Tyron. It was a, a sloppy fight. Even the round he won. Yeah, he got one lucky punch. It was even a bad round. He won. I, I don't think that punch was was lucky. I wouldn't necessarily say. Tom doesn't either, have any accuracy. Trying. They're he not was like. Trying, but the way he was yeah. landing those punches, it was with the like he was like a club punch with the side of his hand, yeah. like a child. That's yeah. what he was swinging, like a little, like a little boy. Yeah, but if, <laughs> if it wasn't a little boy, that's what he was swinging. <laughs> that's, that's the truth. I think the ropes did save. Jake from the knockdown on that, yeah, I think he would have went it's down. Possible. But you no know, argument for that. It's possible. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He no wouldn't have stayed down, but he would have definitely got. Of course, he wasn't even yeah. razz- razzled like the nigga was fine. But what I'm saying is, y'all acting like niggas wanted Jake Paul to win. I just knew it. He would yeah. win. I didn't want the nigga to win. Like what the fuck? I, I was hoping Tyron rather- would get the knockout, but the feints is what fucked him up. Like the nigga seemed frozen and wouldn't like engage in any way. Like gunshot. the nigga wasn't landing. He wasn't landing any punches. The nigga's great at that. Yeah. Regardless of what happens, yeah. Jake Paul is good at that part. That's exactly how he dropped Nate Robinson two times. If you go back and watch the first ro- the first round of that fight with um, Nate Robinson, that's exactly what he hit him with. He threw a, a, le- a lazy jab, he fainted him, and the nigga went up for it. Then he throws that big stupid ass overhand right. Yeah. And it's a, a very hard punch to land with that much accuracy and that much power on it when you're stepping back. The nigga was stepping back and threw that. First of all, that's a real dumb punch to throw, yeah. unless you're like a really super amateur or you're just wild confident. The nigga's getting away from this nigga. He's retreating and he throws an overhand, bang, and he put him down every time he landed it. And it was the same exact setup in the second in the second round. So you can't say it's any luck. No, the nigga's I'm, doing the no, same shit. He throws a lazy left and he faints, and the fight. niggas go with the faint. He throws a lazy left and, and he faints, and the niggas go with it, and then he throws the shit on a retreat. Dang, that's hard to but, do. But part of why it also works is the size advantage. Of yeah. course. Yeah. Yeah. My thing yeah. is, the way Tyron Woodley's standing is what a nigga that's defending against all those other things, mm. those other elements of being takedown defense, that's what kicks, like. yeah. all those yeah. other different kind of strikes that he's used to defending. The nigga's not standing like a boxer. He doesn't have any, he didn't exhibit any signs of boxing capability. Yeah. And even his setups. He throws a big, he launches a big power punch, regardless if he hits you or not. Now you're on retreat, and then he can scoop you scoop, or yeah. hit you with something else. True. I agree. He was it's definitely never, fighting It's never like MMA set up, fight. like set up for punches or even power punches, he's, whatever kind he's of He's not a boxer. And it was it's simply not a boxer. Tyron's obvious. always so, used boxing to set up takedowns. I agree with that 110%. I wouldn't like, even you know, say he's used boxing. Stupid. What? No. I wouldn't even say he used boxing to punches. set up a take. Yeah. He's never a boxer. He's not a boxer at all. This yeah. nigga is really in the gym sparring actual boxers. And if you listen to them niggas talk, they're even saying the nigga's going to surprise people. He can punch, shit like that. You know what I'm saying? He's in there. This is a big white nigga with a big chin, B. 
Pause. Now, this is what it is. I, I want to see him fight an actual boxer now. Like, of course. I think he's upgraded now, like fight a real uh, boxer. It ain't gonna happen though. You see his footwork is horrible. Yeah. He's, he's not gonna fight a real boxer. He's not going to, and he shouldn't. The nigga's just smartest shit in the world of what he's doing. He's capitalizing off a whole bunch of talk. We talking about this nigga right now. He ain't talking about us. Yeah. We discussing this nigga's bullshit ass fight work versus a champ like Tyron Woodley's champion. But in yours, stick to what you know. And keep whipping niggas. Ain't nothing wrong with just whipping niggas out at your weight and, class and what you do, yeah. or whatever you're good at. If you're nice I at mean, ping pong, stay in that. Let's let's be honest. I like agree. this is this is the end of if he was to be able to somehow get a win out of this, yeah. maybe he would be able to leverage that to nah. something. But this is the end of his career. It's, it's quiet. It's though. a wash after the niggas I mean. too tall. It's not like he's too gifted and talented. Like we're not about to he's gas the nigga like Jake Paul's nice. I'm just three saying. Three MMA it was clear. losses. Yo. Four. Back to back too. Yeah, cool. Do we do we know He's any actual fighters player. in the cruiserweight d division? I don't. I can't think of a cruiserweight right now. Uh, oh oh oh! Some from Philly. Gabe Gabriel Rosado. He's like one seventy four. Is it? Whoa. He, he moved up to cruiserweight. Around, he walks around pretty brolic. Um. Um. Gabe Rosado. I'm not gonna lock his team being Gabe Rosado. <laughs> nah, that's my guy. Bugging. bugging the fuck out. Hell no. But, but we're not putting Jake Paul up against any real fighter. He's not going to fight a boxer. Yeah. That wouldn't be It smart. wouldn't be smart for him. If he does, salute. Super respect to him. You know what I'm saying? I respect yeah. everybody that gets in there because lose, win. Facts. I respect the niggas with zero wins and 30 losses. It's still some gangster yeah. shit to do. Yeah, he's you going to just keep, die in there. Niggas he's just going to keep making more money off these fucking fights because like, people at this point are just paying to see him lose. Yeah, and I wasn't saying that because Gabe Rosado is a bad fighter. He just has bad luck. Yeah, but fights. ain't nobody training to lose. So when you yeah. get in there with a nigga... For it's a possibility a nigga whip it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Out, you know what I'm saying? Pause, though. So I respect you wanna, everybody. You want to keep bringing in fighters where there's just enough, like, doubt where it's like, oh, he might lose this one because that's what's going to bring the... Yeah. It's very yeah. smart what he's doing. Yeah, it's genius. has never been foreseen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's unprecedented so congrats territory. congrats to him, man. Nah, all right, fuck all that. I'm just And saying. Tom Woodley, this is his biggest payday. He's going to be able exactly. to take care of his family Dope. and all he, that. Now, congrats to him. Congrats to him. Congrats he to him. Yeah. My nigga, that's who you yeah. salute. Yeah. That's who you congrats to. Congrats to him. Nigga, he spun take a bag out of it. Yeah. That wasn't embarrassing at all. At all. Eight anything, rounds, he was barely touched. I think, barely touched, my nigga. He's if anything, I think these fights are highlighting the disparity between the payment MMA fighters are getting in the boxes fighting. These MMA guys is jumping through hoops. Can't. To get into one of these silly ass fights, Word. just yeah. to be able to to get some bread. I don't you fight. I need to see you in there, my nigga. Man. You gotta fight nigga. somebody. Nah, nigga. You got to. Dog, nah. you know how much money we gonna get off? Nah, that? I'm good, man. He, he gonna try Rez. to do it. He gonna do the Mayweather defense to show this shit. Yo, Rez. Nah, don't. Yeah. Do that. Nah, <laughs> you gonna tag your shit up crazy. <laughs> Pause, Rez. Nah. You gotta fight one of them nah. YouTuber niggas, nah. man. You have to. Nah, I, I need. You know how we gonna cash nah, in? I'm cool. I'm good. I need some some black only, YouTubers only to get in on it though. I'm fighting poverty, man. Like that's. Not <laughs> the, that's what I'm Yo, Red, nah, you gotta I fight one of them niggas, nah. man. Why don't you fight? Who am I fight, nigga? I'm somebody. I'm faint, nigga. I'm a faint. I got seven punches. Nah, I'm good, nigga. If nigga don't go out, y'all gotta throw the towel. <laughs> I ain't boxing. Nah, our no best, best probably Amar. Word. No, definitely. I would, know, I would absolutely get I in there. Yo, son. I, yeah, I would get in there. My nigga, I'm not boxing nobody that's a boxer in my life. If I mean, nah, I would do it like if this. If a nigga in front of me outside, it's whatever. That's a but different, you gotta think about it. Thing. I ain't no boxer. Niggas ain't box. You swing on somebody because you felt emotional at the time. Mm. Right? Nigga try to front on you. You want to embarrass him and cause him pain. So you swing. I done punched, man, I punched a thousand niggas. Pause. You know what I'm saying? But to be fighting in the ring? That's I ain't a, ready for that. Dope, no, that's an interesting point. I ain't ready for that. To go out and fight somebody in like a good or neutral mood? You're not even upset. You're just going out Duh, to fight somebody. felt emotional. Yeah. I never set up a fight next spring. Watch. Oh, yeah. I, nigga, <laughs> I, I ain't even mad at you, my nigga. I ain't even mad at you. you. You front on me. I will swing. Whoever it is, my nigga, nigga, slap me or some wild shit. We're gonna find but Pop, it out. Men mentally, you can get you can get you can get your mind wrapped around. My nigga, I like to laugh so much. I be yeah. laughing while I'm punching people, son. But like, at, not anymore. I be chilling. Yeah. Peace and One tranquility, piece. my nigga. Like, <laughs> yeah. That would be, honest, be the worst to way to be honest, get beat up man, by a nigga just laughing. The I just fought niggas while I'm laughing because I'm like, yo, stay still, stupid nigga. I can see what you're trying to do, mm. and I'm putting it together in my mind. You, you feel me? I'm mm. laughing. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that. But so what I'm saying. You're doing commentary in, while you're fighting. In real life, though, to be boxing, mm -hmm. I respect them niggas because I ain't there for that. I ain't ready for I, that. A ton of respect, but I've played many contact sports, and yeah. I think you you do go into it with the mentality of, I got to have bad intentions. Yeah, and so, yeah, I think course, I could definitely course. get in the ring and not have a problem yeah. with I'm not fucking with it. I'm going to keep it 100. That's why but I the money was there. I done niggas. swung on everything. So, Paul, I'm going to swing on the nigga. That's no issue. Yeah. But you got to think about it. You don't actually stand out there. Like, though, I'm a scuffler. 
You know what I'm saying? I understand. You hook the nigga, you try to drag him and, yeah. shit and try to embarrass and, you know what I'm saying, brutalize. Mm -hmm. You feel me? It don't really go to like, that's like chess, my nigga. That shit is ill. I don't got it. It's that. a science. I respect yeah. them niggas. I, no, that's Everybody like be them chatting niggas. about how nice they are with their hands until they actually see Until it. you get hit. You that's feel when me? Really... Yeah. Until a nigga, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then you say, holy shit, I wasn't prepared for that. A nigga be faster and stronger than you think. You feel me? You think that's why niggas like hype up shit during fights and start beefs and shit just to get themselves... Oh yeah. yeah, possibly, possibly. Yeah, fighters. I think fighters definitely do that where they, through the trash talk and other yeah. shit. Like they find reasons to not be mad, yeah. be mad, and not like. Nigga, how you mad at them? Y'all both getting paid. Yeah. I don't even hardly know the nigga. Yeah, but I guess you could feel disrespected though, because he feel like he could beat you. He called you out, so and, that's why you mad. You feel me? I mean, and not only that, pulling up to take care of their families is tough to be. It, upset at that. It's yeah. money. You know what I mean? This law is gonna cost me money. Yeah. So I think yeah, it's easier I think for nobody, them to fight. Like I just said, my nigga, I don't think the niggas are training to lose. That's why I respect right. everybody to get in there. My thing is, it's different, my nigga. A boxing match, nigga, you out there 12 minutes, 8 minutes, however many minutes. Get it popping, son, Paul. I ain't yeah, no. Crazy, if the money was put up, I would, but it would have to be. Ain't nobody watching that shit, though. Nah, for, it gotta be we not there. He's a fucking celebrity. That's a fact. This is a celebrity. Why do you nigga. keep saying that? That's a fact. We're not fighting nobody. Nah. Nigga, I'm not, not fighting any stash. Oh. Nah, but <laughs> I'm, I'm not fighting. <laughs> we legit. We need. We need some black YouTubers or like influencers. Somebody get nah, in. Nah, I don't want Reg fighting white, black niggas. I want Reg nah, nah, fighting nah, white nah. niggas only. Not, not Reg fighting yeah. them, but just like getting on that on that bread. Oh yeah, yeah, fire, yeah, world. Let's see academics versus Drewski or some shit like that. It's never gonna happen. It'll never. Happen. Be I know it'll never happen. No, it's never gonna it'll happen. Never happen. Oh, what's the other dude? That's Fat good, boy that's and, a good and one Drewski. Right there. Let's see them fight. Ain't nobody fighting. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, for for the bread, I think. Get high enough, they, they nah, fight. Nah. Certain it niggas, might. certain niggas. Because did Blueface just do a fight? I mean, if the bread is right, niggas. Bread. Yeah, yeah. Do some of these niggas. But man. Blueface is six oh. seven, yeah. fighting yeah. the little the little white boy. And don't get me wrong, I'm not saying Blueface can't fight or anything like that. But yeah. uh, who's not taking that fight? Yeah. But boxing is different. Like I said, nigga, front on you. Like you know, what I'm saying you somewhere where there's no cameras at, and somebody try to front flex. Drag him, you know what I mean? But my certain fights in the ring, my nigga. Nah, that shit is different. Like when I ain't that, fucking with it. I'll, I'll, I'll fight any of them racist cops, kill Breonna Taylor, or any of them. Like I told you, my nigga, y'all find any white niggas that be doing racist shit out. I, I, I lost money on that Kimbo fight it. where he fight. He fought that like Seth Petruzzelli. Oh, 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 yeah, Chris, um, I, I lost money on that fight. Yo, can I say What's his name? Chris what? I can't remember. Nah, isn't it Seth? Hell no. Seth Petruzzelli or some shit like that. Uh, nigga with the red hair. Yeah. Kimbo versus. White nigga with red hair. Hey, nigga fucking brutalized him. Um, Seth Petruzzelli. Ooh. Told you. That is yeah. him. Yeah. Hell Seth yeah. Petruzzelli. Told you. Word. That's that nigga right there, too. And he looks mad regular, so we did not expect that. Nah. But he was a he was a last minute replacement. Who, Seth? Yeah. He's supposed to fight. Word, that, he's supposed to fight Shamrock. Yeah. Word? Never anytime there's a, a, a last Kimbo's minute. Supposed to fight Shamrock? Yeah, anytime oh, there's a last minute crazy. replacement. Don't ever take the bet. Yeah. Because you've been training for Shamrock. somebody else. Yeah. Damn, son. And he saw the, and he saw the little white boy and he was like, nah, I got this. Respect. And he really did. Man, that was that nigga, man. Kimber was piece. that guy, man. Word. That's a scuffler though. You see what I'm saying? My yeah. son's out there for the scuffle. When he get in there, though, it's, it's totally different. Half what? of Kimbo's fights, though, I was like, it was a psychological thing. Cause yeah. like a nigga will punch him and he was like, yeah. Was, you should get the Kimbo. Why would I the do that? The braids? <laughs> like that? That'd be fire. Uh, <laughs> that, I mean, Kimbo? it's my dream to get to Darnell, man. Imagine like, you I get mean, to Kimbo. It's just I don't have enough hair to. <laughs> yeah, 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 you can't do that. It's mad, yeah. It's too... <laughs> you can't do that. But the Kimbo would fire. You got the Kimbo? It's like popcorn, my. <laughs> but my hair? Yeah. I twist it, man. I do my shit. He said I twist it. <laughs> like kernels, he said wild sore. <laughs> yeah. Genius. Genius. Sound. Sound. What you thought? What you tell me what you thought? What you thinking? What you thought? What you thought? What you thought? Ah, what, what you thought? Tell me what you thought? What you thinking? What you thought? What you thought? What you thought? Ah.